Here you go, fine gentlemen. I think you sound part of the noise. Okay. This nut is loose. So that means the ball joint will just tape it into the knuckle. That shot. And I look over here, and I see the clamp. And you can turn this and you hear it. And when you feel it up inside, you can feel that the tie rod, in the tie rod, and it's loose to the rack. So, and you can see they did a strut, an end link. So, plus there's something wrong with the rack. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder how far this stuff back this car was. Ooh. Cross members kinked. Please tell there's alignment holes here. It's pushed back in the hole and it's now touching right here. Oh, this one's still got the rubber plug in there, it didn't fly out. It's not making contact there. And it's dragged along the ground for a while. For a long while. On both sides. So it's up to here. So either this thing was bad, or we're sitting in a boneyard with no tires on it and just winched it up. Okay, this broke, so they shoved it in that hole. Awesome. Awesome. I'm afraid to look at the back. Oh, the rail thing. The rails are intact in the back. It's all ripped out. I'm sure this thing's been tugged a little bit. Look at this. It's gone. This thing was one hell of a ride. There's only one thing I can do. I can condemn it, tell them it's not safe to drive it. Send it back to a body shop. I'll tell you right now, it's a little ball joint. It needs a spindle. It needs whatever's wrong with this. The rack is bound. And some real body work. 